Hi, Noah. How's it going? Jesse, good morning. Morning. <laughs> Is it early over there? No, 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 not at all. It's, uh, it's 11.30. I'm in oh, New York. Oh, perfect. My time too, East Coast. All right, East Coast bros. All right, here we go. You know? <laughs> okay, Jesse. So let's go ahead and get started because I want to play a fun game with you in this interview. This is going to be a whole lot of fun, but let's go ahead and get started with Chicago PD. So, you know, kind of give our viewers an overview of what's really happened so far during the fall season of Chicago PD. Uh, just a quick catch up to where we are because we're at our fall finale. Uh -huh. um, there was a there was a case where uh, basically Jay locked up the wrong guy. Um, um, you know he was sure that this guy uh, was good for a double murder, uh -huh. and um, and he turned out to be innocent, but he ends up being murdered in prison. And oh, no. Jay can't let it go. It's it's he's racked with guilt. You know Jay has this big heart, and uh, and he really takes the case home with him. And he tries to start helping out the guy's family. Um, and he doesn't tell anybody about it. Um, but it gets him into a really sticky situation that becomes a life or death situation uh, because uh, the guy's wife was involved with some drug dealers. Mm. Um, so it's, mm -hmm. uh, Jay might not make it out of this one alive. It has repercussions for the whole unit. Uh, Haley, Jay's partner, you know, and uh, she really cares about Jay and she's the one always pulling him back. Uh, it's going to have a really strong effect on her, and uh, and we'll see what happens. But it's life or death. Well, you know, when the show returns in 2020 with new episodes, I just want to ask you, you know, where would you like to see the show go? Or where would you like to see the show pick up in 2020? Um, I, I, uh, I think that Jay and Voight's character have been getting closer. I think they trust each other a lot more. Mm -hmm. uh, they, they both respect that, you know, each of them is a good cop in their own right trying to do the job their own way. And I think that uh, we've seen them grow, and, I, and I, I'd like to see that relationship keep developing. Fantastic. Okay, Jesse, so now it's time to play our fun game. I think the fans are really going to enjoy this a lot. Uh, this is called Beat the Clock. It's just, it's just a funny little game I came up here at iHollywood TV. I'm going to ask you a rapid-fire round of random questions that fans would like to know about you. So let's see if you can beat the clock. All right, so if you could play a 90s kid character, who would it be and why? Oh, my God. The 90s kid character? I don't even know what, what was on in the 90s. Um, no. Oh, well, hold on. Wait. Let's move on. Uh, if you could eat one of your favorite meals for an entire week, what would it be and why? Ooh. Mac and cheese. Craft mac and cheese. That's like, that's Ooh. comfort food. Oh, I love it. All right, what's something that you, didn't, that, that you don't think you have ever shared with your fans but you wouldn't mind sharing uh, with them this morning? That I've never showed my fans? Yeah, that was uh, something that you never share with them. My golf swing. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll post more videos to Instagram. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Who is your celeb crush if you have one? Celeb Ooh. crush. Oh, man. I mean, it used to be like Elizabeth Hurley when I was younger. Oh. Or like Kate Beckinsale. Yeah, how about that? Oh, good one. Oh, I like that. Mine's Jennifer Anderson. All right, which TV show series was your favorite growing up? Uh, growing up, I watched... Oh, man. It depends on what age, but, like, Patty and I were talking, Ruzek and I, we were talking about uh, Power Rangers the other day, how much uh, we used to watch that. <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> Power Rangers. Oh, no. We're out of time. Look there, Jesse. Oh, you only See, got I, three I didn't. No, <laughs> no million yeah. bucks from you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's okay. I just want to ask another one because these are kind of really good. Um, oh, I like this one, Jesse. If you were not acting today, what other career would you have chosen as a backup? Oh, gosh. I don't even know. I probably would have ended up, uh, I don't know, teaching or something in psychology or something like that. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, gosh. I don't know what my backup plan would have been. Huh? <clears throat> you know? <laughs> All right. Well, be sure to catch the fall, uh, the fall final of Chicago PD Wednesday, November the 20th at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time only on NBC. I tell you, these Chicago shows, they're so popular. They, they are loved by so many, and I can't wait to see what's going to happen. And I so greatly appreciate you taking some time to chat with me. It was a whole lot of fun getting to talk with you this morning. Thanks. You too. Appreciate it. You take care now. You too. All right. Bye-bye.